tactics and enhances quality of life? What's the city's fiscal responsibility in creating economic development? So, who are we up next? You? Craig. It's me. Yeah, here we go. Uh, there's so much to do, and, and we're absolutely responsible for helping to facilitate that as city leaders. I want to fund an economic developer position again in consult with the chamber, with the city, with whomever is ready to help influence the, the, these efforts. I actually think, and I know this is tough sometimes, but the Cheetah Slow is, it's hard, Cheetah Slow and Chamber, there, there seems to be an edge between them. This is Sebastopol. We need to fund things that bring business here. Whether they're coming for Cheetah Slow, they're coming for the parade. I'm, I'm interested in, in closing that chasm that's been created. Uh, we need to be saving for a rainy day. When I was on the council, we saved a lot of money. During the recession, that money was used to keep the city afloat. So that's part of economic development. We need to make it easier to build affordable housing for people to split their homes. You know, if they need to carve out a little granny, uh, if they need to have, you know, get the fees waived, I support those concepts. That helps move economic growth. And you know, when I was on the council, we put in 12 municipal solar projects, saving money. We need to help do that with, with uh, private interests as well. Thank you. Thank you, Craig. And Jonathan? Thank you. Um, I, I think that uh, a hospital is very important to a community to keep it open in terms of the businesses. I think libraries, where people go on Mondays and evenings, help the vitality of the city. Those are important services. I'd like to see an electric car jitney that takes people from out of the city into the city that runs around on an electric car that people could use. I support um, what I call a dollar, uh, you know, a, 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 a car per thousand dollars of tax revenue analysis of new businesses that require parking like the hotel and stuff like that so that we could approve businesses that build upon, upon our, our tax base um, and trade traffic for that. Um, I think auxiliary housing is enormously important. Waiving um, fees and red tape in return for housing to be built that, uh, that costs less and stays rented for under $1,000 is a tremendous resource for our community, for our businesses who cannot find workers who can afford to live here. Thank you, Jonathan. Lisa. Okay, so smart growth. I mean, uh, there's lots of examples of it. We do have a lot of a lots within the city that are not creating tax revenue for us so that we can get the things we want, like um, better parks and bike lanes, etc. I am. I have heard about the economic development position that that people are talking about. I wholeheartedly support that. I think that there, if there was somebody that was both seeking and in, in, uh, being open to smart growth coming to Sebastopol, that would benefit us. Um, Amy's, I wish we had Amy's come in and my son would be eating there instead of Taco Bell. So, um, you know, the hotel is gonna bring us tax revenue and jobs. Hopefully they'll do a living wage for their workers. So um, those are the kind of projects that I think benefit everyone in Sebastopol. Michael? The city doesn't have a lot of money, so I would encourage rather than spending it on an economic um, development person to instead invest that money towards policy and creating policy that creates economic development. I think that one way would be to um, for the city to absorb the initial cost for the impact fees for an additional unit, a uh, grain unit, something of that sort, and then amortize that fee out on your water bill over a time period, so that way it would encourage more people to build grain units, which would encourage people to stay in town, provide workers housing, um, and that in, in having more people in town would create more economic um, vitality, it would create more, more money for the city. Thank you, Michael.